Hey my little truffles, how y'all doing? It's your favorite girl, Kyla Black. Y'all, we need to take a deep dive into all the shady stuff Doja Cat and Piola have been doing recently. Because the numbers ain't adding up, y'all, and it's so heartbreaking to see other female artists in the rap world who are doing better and have a better fan game but yet cannot make it to Billboard top charts because some people are being opportunistic and are taking things too far. I'm talking about Doja Cat, y'all. Doja is practically turning into the next Cardi B aka Floppy B who has no organic fan base but yet gets to top chart. Here is proof to back all of what I'm saying. First off, when Doja dropped her first single Attention and everyone paid dust to it and then she releases Paint the Town Red which is a good song but not an eat song for it to be breaking this amount of records. Because if y'all can remember, when Paint the Town Red dropped, Angels by Hailey Bailey broke more records and had more YouTube views compared to Paint the Town Red and now it's breaking records. So here's what's being reported. Doja Cat's Paint the Town Red has surpassed 50 million streams on Spotify. And it boils down to the question, how the hell did this happen? Y'all, so it turns out, Doja's recording contract allegedly comes with a Spotify deal and now it makes sense the numbers add up because if you notice she's breaking records mainly on Spotify and not on Billboard and this explains why she hasn't gone top 5 on Billboard's 100 despite getting this massive amount of audience and fan support like she claims. And before y'all be like Paint the Town Red is viral on TikTok and that's why it's getting this much streams on Spotify well newsflash y'all. Paint the Town Red is on TikTok, but it's not as viral as the claim it is. And not forgetting, Doja ain't got any organic fan base who's out there supporting her. Like, this doesn't add up because all her massive fan pages on Twitter have practically deactivated themselves because they don't want to be associated with someone who's so disrespectful ungrateful and this is them at every given opportunity and now this makes sense why she said she does not care about her fans because she knows she got piola and spotify to help her boost paint the town red with fake overhype how do you feel about all of this please let me know in the comment section below do you think i'm doing too much or saying too much i want to know moving on to the next topic y'all doja cat scarlet album will reportedly have 20 tracks and will be 55 minutes long that's a literally a lot of singles to listen to but the question is would the songs be worth listening to or is it just gonna be overhyped like paint the town red by piola and spotify let me know in the comment section below and it turns out two of these tracks have already been released and it's attention and paint the town red i personally think the album is gonna be do good but not great why because She's still in her self-sabotaging era and it's only getting all of the support from Piola and the fake hype. So it might go number one as well as it might not if we're being realistic and facing the real audience and fan base. Please like, subscribe and do not forget to let me know what you think in the comment section below and turn on your notification buttons so that I don't miss out on all the things.